beauty uh -huh. from the mind of Sergio Santos. Oh man, beauty. There's so many degrees of beauty. Um, to me, growing up, um, just uh, the neighborhoods that I was in, everything was already always dilapidated. Like buildings had rust coming off of them. Um, and it sounds morbid, like when you just describe it. But as a kid, that stuff was gorgeous to me. And it, it informed my photography and it continues to... Stuff like this, the things, your environment as a child, it doesn't leave you ever. And it's still something I gravitate towards. Like, I like the... Like when paint drips, when it causes textures, when it's... You know, I wouldn't say accidentalism because it's, it's with purpose that I'm getting it to look that way. But, like I said, there's degrees of beauty, but that's one of them for me. It's like, I like that raw, that raw look. And it never, it never ceases to, to inspire me. They say it's an eye of the beholder. Uh huh. True. Everything is. Um, and that's why that's why there's all different types of everything: religion, art, music. Because they say that we state that we humans have a set. This is a beautiful person because of instinct. Like there's a standard. There, there's a scientific. Like when they Distance do... of eyes, you know, width of nose, angle of chin, height of cheeks. But then I think there's also um, taste. That may be perfect. Or, or even just making something perfect. Like I said, like I like the distress look. Like when I see neat little stuff, and it depends. But in general, I'm like, my eyes are glazed over. So, I mean, that's an example. But even, like, you're talking about eye distance. You know, maybe I don't like them that far. Or maybe, maybe I like crooked noses. Maybe, there's always that. So I don't, I mean, sure, there's science to stuff, but. Your artwork seems to have no organization to it. No method. I mean, part of it. It's always going to be contrived. There is a method. At this point, um, I'm close to 500 paintings that I've made. So there, there is a method, and although it's um, just emotion that builds it, uh, there comes to be a method. There comes to be things that I do to make something. But. A lot of it, to me, part of the process is that I want it to be a surprise. I didn't plan on making this figure, but it appeared, and it kept talking to me. Um, so. You think there'll ever be a piece where here's a straight line, here's a perfect circle, here's a triangle, here's a... Like I said, never say never. I mean, I could, like, get abducted or something. And you know, just start drawing lines because I can't recover from it. You know, anything could happen. Things happen, so never say never. I could, like, yeah, just come to hate this style that I'm doing and, like, deny my past work. Anything could happen. I mean, that's, um... And I'm open to it. Bring it. 